all twerking like Molly. What's up YouTube today? We are doing a commentary on the Black Ops 3 beta. It is currently 12 o'clock at night. Um 12 12 actually, no joke, look. 12 12. Um and the beta ends at 1 o'clock Eastern time where I live because I live in Canada, Ontario. Um, but let's get it before the ends. I wanted to throw these things in and let's get it. We're gonna load up some TDM. Hopefully, there's actually been a lot of laggy games on this game recently. A lot of people were saying um, there's really a lot of laggy actually games. You know what? I'm not gonna use a sniper. Um, I would go for trick shots. I hit two trick shots on this game so far, but they were both barrel stuff. Um, and there are two pieces, but they're really barrel stuff, like really barrel stuff, and they're 360s. So I'm not gonna use them in anything. Um, <clears throat> but uh, the only thing, the uh, only reason I'm not going for trick shots in this game is because um, uh, I can't do a, get a six man with anybody. I don't have none of my friends play PS4. Where I'm only, I usually am an Xbox player, as you guys know from watching my content on my channel. Also, guys, I really wanted to talk about this topic recently. Phase Jev released his 1 million uh, subscriber video, and it really got to me. It made me really happy. I almost cried from it. It's an amazing video, guys. I suggest you really check it out. Strongly check it out. Um, it's a very good. Uh, congrats, Jev, for 1 million sus subs. You really deserve it, man. I love you. Wish you the best. And also, congrats on Phase Rain for hitting 2 million subs. Personally, I think Phase Rain is a big motivator for kids and for even adults too. Like, just because Phase Rain wanted, because his uh, setup is in the basement, he made a video about how this kid wanted the setup in the basement, and I did. I'll, I'll, I'm gonna make an excuse. Yes, I did. I really, I want my, my setup in the basement. It'd be pretty sick. Like this setup right here, you're just chilling. Devon Dahar, can you put the TV? Put SpongeBob, please, and thank you. Cherry on top. Um, also, guys, I've been getting since I left Coral. I've been getting around 10 dislikes per video. I just gained a whole bunch of dislikes, and it's probably some of the Coral members. Um, I know that for a fact, so I banned some of them. I banned a lot of people from my channel. I banned about 20 people today. Um, just from my channel. So hopefully my dislikes go down or. <clears throat> my likes go up because I really if you guys dislike the video please comment why that would really mean a lot because I don't like people just saying oh just disliking my video and not commenting why it really does bug me it feels like I'm doing something wrong with my channel and my content and yeah also guys a lot of people were wondering um, why I do YouTube and they think I'm just a money maker and all that for proof I don't even make money off of YouTube I don't I didn't set up my AdSense account because it's it's difficult for me and I don't feel like doing it anytime soon. Um, I don't care for the money. I just care for producing you with entertainment and excitement. I really do like. I love when people just say it's the best feeling in the world when they say I love your content, man. You're, it just makes me feel so good and playing with fans and them reacting. It's it feels so good. Like hopefully one day I really could get big. I really want to grow my channel with you guys and. We're doing that really fast. My channel been growing pretty big recently. Um, the only other 13 year olds I know that have a YouTube channel is Mr. Green Pandas with that 36k, because he most likely sub bought it. I'm I'm not gonna say that for a fact, but that's what most people say. It's just crazy how he got that big already, just from one setup video. Also, Fell Desire, he's uh, at 27k, I'm pretty sure, and it's reasonable because his dad's a YouTuber and he has a lot of subs. He has around like 50k, I'm pretty sure. And then J1 or something, he has 5k, he just does videos, congrats to him, I'm happy for you. Ooh, let's go. Also guys, the, the most craziest thing in this game, which I love, is the wall run, guys. It's one of the best things that they added to the game, personally, in my opinion. I really do like it. I like the feature. I just love the touch. I love the controls of the PS4 controller. I was a PS3 player originally, then I moved to Xbox because a lot of the big players play on it. But now, I'm just so... I'm first. Let's go, boy. Let's go. Let's go. So I got something to show you guys right now. Uh, if a lot of you guys don't know, my webcam's here, and this is my PS4. 
over here is my computer, which I'm looking at right now. Um, I got this cool thing to show you. So, this is one of my best Black Ops 2 FFA lead right here. I'll pop it up on the screen right now. Um, I was 29 and the last person was at 10. It was a crazy lead. I was actually really like, oh my god, this was my biggest milestone. That, that'd be sad. This is probably so cheesy. Biggest milestone for um, a lead on FFA. Also, um, this uh, picture right here. Check it out. I was 27 and 14. I think that's a really good score for me. That's almost 30 kills on a TDM game. Um, it's pretty good. I think I'm actually mostly every Call of Duty that I that comes out, I get a good hang of it, and I do good at the game. I'm not gonna. I'm not, I don't want to be cocky or anything. I'm just saying that I'm personally like uh, really good at just any Call of Duty types. Hopefully, you guys like the YouTube video. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you guys dislike the video, please tell me why. And it been your boy Tazy and Mel. Peace.